The Crystal Healing Certification Program is coming soon. Want to know more? For info, free training, and to get on the list, go to crystalhealerschool.com. Hey everyone, Ashley here from the Love and Light School of Crystal Therapy, and I am doing kind of an impromptu Facebook Live. I wasn't expecting to be live right now, um, but I was just feeling really called to reach out and connect with everyone and talk a little bit about the importance of holding sacred space in our lives and the importance of spiritual connection in our lives. Um, so you might know <laughs> around here at the school, we're busily getting ready for my crystal healing certification program, which opens for enrollment next week. So it's been really crazy and hectic and there's just been so much going on. Um, hi to Debbie. Welcome, Debbie. Um, but it's just, it's been really busy. <laughs> uh, and I love what I do. I love the work that I get to do. I love the people that I get to connect with, but it's still sometimes really stressful, right? Even though it's this like really beautiful thing that we're creating here at the school. And I just got done with my meditation practice for the day and it helped me really reflect on the importance of that in my life. Um, the importance of taking that time to connect with my inner self and tune in and listen to my intuition and connect with my spiritual guides and teachers and connect with that spiritual aspect of myself. And even how in my business, um, not just in my personal life, but even in my business, how my spirituality, my spiritual practice is so aligned with everything that I do. And it really kind of flows into all the work that we do here in the school and it's really like the driving force behind why I do this work you know and so in this meditation that I just finished it really came through very strongly um how you know it was, it's kind of loud and clear that you know the, the reason that I do this work teaching about crystals is because I want everyone to be able to have that deep connection with their healing stones. I want everyone to have those spiritual moments throughout their day. Um, thank you, Debbie. You're so sweet. I feel, <laughs> I feel like I have total sleepy face, <laughs> but thank you. I just, I am, I just, I got this really like profound message about how important it is for all of us to do this kind of work right now. And, and whether you do that with crystal healing or you do your work with aromatherapy and essential oils or guided meditation or hi <laughs> my beautiful golden retriever cc has decided to come hang out um or you work with animals maybe whatever that work is that you do do it with as much passion as you can possibly muster because the world needs that work. The world needs that gift. The world needs you to really step into your soul path and bring forward what you can. Um, and so although I didn't have much of a plan for exactly what I wanted to say here, I was just feeling really called to share that message. Um, and also talk about, you know, how this isn't, something that <laughs> yes darling i know <laughs> this isn't something that we just do sometimes this is something that we really step into fully and this is something that is is part of you so when you're doing this kind of healing work if you're just doing it for yourself and your friends and your family and loved ones or you're working with clients or whatever it is um, this is something that we do to share our gifts, and it's not something that we just turn on and off. It's something that we live and we breathe every day as lightworkers, as empaths, as healers, 
And I think that we all have that innate within us, right? We all have that. And it comes very naturally to many of us. Um, and so really holding space in that for your life, whether that be through meditation or whether it's through creating something beautiful that you want to share with the world, I just encourage you to fully step into that. Um, and, and, you know, I'm going to get real <laughs> right now. Like, don't half-ass it. If you have something beautiful to share and give and create and explore and embody, then do it 100%. Do it 110%. Um, because that gift that you have to share is needed by someone out there. Someone needs what you have. And they need that connection. They need that nourishment, that encouragement, that love um, that only you can give in your special, unique way. And so that's my message for today. Not a big one, um, but something that I feel very passionate about and, and something that I just felt really called to speak up about right now. So hold space for that in your life. If you feel like you haven't been able to step into your soul path, if you've been feeling like there are blocks and obstacles on your path, things that you need to overcome, then commit to making some progress this week. Um, commit to making progress today, to overcoming those obstacles so that you can get to that point in which you're able to really share 100% of yourself. And yeah, that's it. So thank you for hearing me. And I hope that you have a beautiful evening. And um, I will be back with you again soon. The Crystal Healing Certification Program is coming soon. Want to know more? For info, free training, and to get on the list, go to crystalhealerschool.com.